What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Ideal Tone, and I'm back to make it known that I'm here with another reaction video. And this time, I am joined by a friend of mine. Y'all know this gentleman, all right? The one, the only maestro, all right? This is the first time I've had a guest actually with me for a reaction. And the reason for that being is maestro is the one who is tempting and encouraging and pushing me to do this reaction video for the simple fact that he's been fighting for me to play this game for about a year ain't that right bro <laughs> what's up y'all uh <laughs> my god, my god, like that. My god. <laughs> it's the truth it's the truth <laughs> listen it's, it's been like six months um, oh wow so... really we're gonna lie and say it's been <laughs> six <happy> months <laughs> okay <laughs> but um yeah no so um the game in question do you want to do you want to tell everybody what it is yeah so the game in question is well actually you know i feel like i'm gonna mess up the name it's final fantasy 14 what again <laughs> it's uh final fantasy 14 a realm reborn a realm and, reborn. Uh, okay yep so uh the reason why i was pushing it so uh, not so hard but uh the reason why i was pushing it is because uh it's latest expansion and walkers due to be arriving in a about November-ish, I believe, at the end of November. Mm -hmm. And I figure I didn't want you to miss the hype of everybody who's jumping on the MMO train um, to check out this game. It's been a massive success recently, especially with the mass exodus from WoW. A bunch of the content creators are leaving WoW to play Final Fantasy XIV. And you're a dude who loves uh, RPGs. So I figure, hey, maybe this could be a game for you. Yeah, you're right. Now, and for those who don't know what WoW is, because there might be some, uh, WoW is World of Warcraft. Am I, if I'm not mistaken. Oh yeah, it's it's yeah. Mm -hmm. So so yeah. So we're gonna go ahead and dive in. Um, if you guys, you know, appreciate you guys watching. If you like the video, please like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Uh, leave a comment in the, in the description for anything that you want to see, or if you want to see more reaction videos. Or if you want to want to, uh, or you want to watch me <laughs> react to a certain like gaming video or something like that. Um, also, uh, don't forget uh, to check out uh, the sponsor for this video, which will be African Shades. As you guys know from my recent video, um, I recently uh, got a sponsor, uh, um, and they hooking me up, showing. And I'll, you know, if you guys are in the Pennsylvania area. Um, uh, down below there's an image that with the card that shows everything and also in the description you can find like if more information regarding like the location and everything and stuff like that yada yada etc cetera, etc cetera. as well and as well um they are soon coming with um a website and once that website is up and running i will have that in the description as well so definitely check out african shades if you're in the philadelphia or pennsylvania area down at the fashion district easy good a easy good place to get african garbs and all that good stuff you know i wear it all jewelry everything so uh but yeah let's go ahead and dive into this uh this video and see if chris or should i say maestro can get a good reaction out of me <laughs> i'm hoping so all right here yeah, we go man the trailer final fantasy 14 a realm reborn and here we go Oh man, he wasn't lying. <laughs> oh wait, hold up. Yeah, give it a couple seconds. I was about to say the graphics is kind of but but the trailers get prettier. The, like as time goes on, trailers get prettier. This trailer is eight years old. True. What the heck is that? <laughs> Keep watching. Pretty lights. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Them comments sound like they're waking something up. Wait, what? Why is there a war going on at the same time? The, the hell? <laughs> Look at that Robin Hood wannabe. <laughs> It's the dude beyond Diablo. <laughs> I 
Oh, wow. That's a mage mage. There's our hero right there. And I don't know, man. He kind of <laughs> looks like a monster hunter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. They shot him. <laughs> oh, that's his main squeeze. <clears throat> oh, she fierce with the bow. <coughs> mm. I don't know. I don't like that. What the what the hell is that thing? Um Holy That planet just had a baby. <laughs> that planet just had a full grown baby dragon. What the? Holy crap. He's laying waste to everything. Uh-uh, we don't play that in my hood. Uh-uh, we slay elder dragons. What's up, mother? <laughs> Is that Bahamut? Yes, it is. Oh, my God. He got to die. I'm sorry. Bahamut got to die. Oh, he was like, uh-uh, you, you trying to guard against my attack? Mm. Mm, excuse me. Oh, look at them swords of light. What, are they going piercing? Yeah, piercing. Oh, they, oh, okay, they trapping him. They ain't gonna hold. What made you think that was gonna work? He popped out the last egg. He just sacrificed himself. That's wild. Square Enix always got good games, man. <laughs> oh, that's not it? Oh, okay. <laughs> Yo, these chocobos is weird looking.
<laughs> why he got why he the only nigga wearing a riding horse? What the fuck? Like, <laughs> oh, I no, oh, I remember you. <laughs> Bahim, if I oh, oh, I remember you. What race is he? He is a Rogadin. Oh, the, the big guy, right? Yeah, the green guy, yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, like Cobblegoblin. I call bullshit. Uh, they didn't have no chocobos when they teleported. <laughs> I call bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually gonna agree with you on that one. They <laughs> <laughs> call bullshit. Like, and you know what? They heartless too. They heartless too. Uh, you know, Shogobo? huh? <laughs> the Shogobo. No, 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 no. The, the, the people, after they got teleported, they heartless as hell. <laughs> well, so here, uh, I wanted to say something, but it was like in the middle of it. But no, no, no. They they heart, you, want to, you want to know why they heartless? <laughs> why? <laughs> they didn't mourn the old dude's death, even though he sacrificed himself. As soon as they finished teleporting, whatever they were, they were like, all right, call a chocobo. Let's go. We all smiles. <laughs> like, fuck that. Well, <laughs> here's the thing. So they were teleported five years into the future. And Wait, pretty what? much they had to figure. Yeah. So the old guy, the, the old guy teleported the, 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 that. And like everybody who was there who ended up getting teleported they ended up getting teleported five years into the future that's wild yeah so i guess they're trying to figure out what happened so that's the point of this whole of the whole game now like you're trying to you just, no oh so <laughs> so uh that's actually one of the side stories you find out what happened to louis swa the the guy who sacrificed himself yeah and you want to figure out what happened with bahamut why did he die? What the fuck happened? He ain't dead. So that's uh, one of the side stories. As a player, you can go and find out. Yeah, he ain't dead. And then we 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 gonna we gonna kill him though. <laughs> I'll tell you what though, that story for him though, uh, the binding coils of Bahamut, uh, yo, it's probably the epic. It's one of the most epic uh, parts of the game, to be honest. Mm. Okay. All right, Chris, you got my reaction. <laughs> Are you happy now? Yes, that's all I want. <laughs> all right, so this is how I feel about this game. I think it might be fun. In all seriousness, okay? You you got me, Stro. It, it might be fun. It might legit be something I enjoy. Mm. For those of you who are watching, I have made a promise to my good friend here that this week I will be playing Final Fantasy Realm Reborn. Final Fantasy 14 A Realm Reborn. Did I say that right? Yeah. I will be playing that. <laughs> Hey, whether it's a live and, stream or just you know, oh, first, we didn't, you know, we didn't, we didn't agree on that. <laughs> no, no, no I'm did. saying whether it's a live stream or just like a, a bot, it's up to you. It does not matter because I also have a surprise for you. What's that? So, um, Niles, Rob, possibly Ralph, I'm gonna try to get Grim back on. Grim's wants to play again. And there we go. So, we are going. I'm assembling the team to get get on on Friday. To basically handhold your ass. <laughs> <laughs> what makes you and think I need handholding, huh? <laughs> listen, man. I mean, this is, to my knowledge, your first MMO. So we'll see. Uh -huh. And you know, we'll you know probably spend half an hour in the con in the. In the, in what, the what, what about Sword Art Online? Isn't that like MMO kind of base? Oh, what do you mean? I played Sword Art Online. That's kind of MMO-ish. The original game. I'm gonna hurt you. 
Anyway, it's the truth. <laughs> it's the truth. You you well, got cooldowns so, and stuff like that, and well, I've never. I have to look it up. To be honest, I have to look it up because I didn't know. I know Sword Art is based off of an MMO, but I didn't know if it was an actual MMO. Like, I like the way, of... like you you go through different layers. You got to map out stuff, hunt monsters. You gotta when you do. That's, and that when, sounds like a regular RPG, to be honest. And like, other yeah, go ahead. No, then, like, when you're fighting, like, big bosses after mapping out an area and stuff like that, and you find the boss room for the next level or whatever, like, and even when you're regularly fighting, there's a bunch of cooldowns for your different abilities and attacks, and... Hmm. Well, it has elements of RP... Oh, uh, like, cooldowns are definitely an, M- uh, an element in MMOs. Uh, but I have to look at it, because if that's the case, um, then I maybe have to apologize for saying that this is your first MMO. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, no. Um, probably gonna spend like I don't know, however x amount of time it takes for you to make a, con- a character in content creator because there is a lot of options. Um, I think you're gonna have a lot of fun making your character. Is it more? Is it longer than making a monster a character in Monster Hunter World? Way, it's way longer. Oh wow! Yeah, because that was honestly, long. Uh, I'm gonna say this right now um, because, if, like I said, if you end up playing this game, um, it, it's gonna get personal. It's gonna become like you know, you're gonna love your character, you're gonna appreciate them. The story's gonna revolve around the. Pin. <laughs> Honestly, that's what got me hooked. Because mm. uh, where I'm at right now, uh, everyone said it was an emotional roller coaster, and I was, you know, ah, shut up, you don't know what you're talking about. I ain't no bitch. I did tear up a couple of times in that story. <laughs> mm. All right. Well, I will keep my promise, and I will play. Mm. I will play on Friday. But. <clears throat> Thanks to everyone for who watched. Uh, as I said earlier, if you liked the video and enjoyed the topic and the reactions and the conversation, please like, comment, subscribe. Uh, give that notification bell a ring so you can see more videos like this. Uh, leave and don't also, you know, start a conversation of like, what do you guys like me to react to? If you got any suggestions or anything that you would like to see me react to, gaming wise, I'll I'll definitely like. Put it in, consider it, and there may be some games that you guys have. I'm sorry, look, there might be some games that you guys can introduce me to that I don't know about. You know, it's a big world out there, so it is what it is. <clears throat> but yeah, so that's it for this video, guys. Um, also, don't forget to show some love to African Shades, and you know, especially if you're in the Pennsylvania, Philadelphia, Philadelphia area, if you go there and use my name, Ideal Tone, you get five percent off. So, yeah, all right. But as always, I'm your boy, Ideal Tone, and I am here to say later.